Good evening, everybody. Uh, welcome back to Pokemon Crown. I did play... Uh, also, I figured out why my character keeps running. I accidentally pressed the run only button. So I did play some of my own personal game in the meantime. Uh, just to see how much more is in this, what is really left for me to do, or if, like, this part where I'm stuck on is basically the end. Um, what I've found is that I believe I can get through this with, as you can see, I did not, in the end, train the Pokemon that I said I was going to. Um... But I believe I can get through this with the Pokemon I have. It's just... Yeah, this guy was not actually as useful in my other game as I thought he'd be. <clears throat> what did I take out? That's actually a pretty good not to. Um, but what I found is that there are some more quests in the game for me to do, and it does take me back over here. The, uh, the problem is I don't know if everything going forward is actually possible or if it's literally made impossible because, um, pretty soon where the current version of this game is, is where it ends. So, I'll see how far I can get. I'll see if after some side quests I can actually do the uh, the rest of this, but uh, I'm not gonna hold my breath because in my own personal game I can't do it. Though on the other hand, in my personal game I use uh, I start with Croconaw instead of. Uh, uh, Charmander and Charm- uh, I started with Totodile. Not Croconaw. Uh, Totodile instead of Charmander. Oh. So, part of me is thinking maybe just the difference in, uh, you know, now I have, I have fire types. Might be all the difference that I need to beat it. <clears throat> I grew tired of traveling. See to it that this gate is opened without delay. Yes, of course, young master Ad Adair. Attention, guards of Larkholm. Open the gates. The seventh heir to the throne, Adair, has arrived. Lower the bridge. I do love the music that's in this. It's very nice. Open the gates. A member of the royal family has arrived. Clear the gates! <clears throat> Very good. We must make haste. Dogwood, you better have prepared some of the strongest Pokemon in Gwelda for me. Okay, I think I planted. Yes! I would love three Lumberries. I also don't know how much more I'm going to be catching Pokemon for the same reason of, um, there's just not much left right now, and I will pr probably use uh, my money to get some items to improve my Pokemon rather than catching stuff, because... How much money do I still have? I've got a lot. Relatively. <clears throat> so that I'm not sent all the way back to the forest when I lose a battle. And then activating this. Awesome. The one comment that I do have to make about this is I don't think you get money for beating trainers in battles, which I would personally change simply due to the fact that the fast travel system 
is entirely based on you have to pay for it. Uh, bye. I'm gonna get a fire stone. I don't think... Oh, Pikachu. Right. Is there anything in this game that evolves with a leaf stone? I don't think so. I'm gonna get a fire stone. Because I do have Vulpix in my party. I think. Yeah, I was gonna raise Vulpix up. Probably gonna take... I might take Curlia out. Bye. I don't need any of that. I absolutely love living here in Lockholm. I feel so safe within castle walls. That's nice. Uh, oh right, okay, I do know who these guys are. So these guys will take my potions, and if I have, I think it's two or three of any potion, uh, they'll raise it up to the next level so that I can get higher and higher tier potions. This guy won't share his books with me. I remember that from my own playthrough. And by playthrough, I mean I'm like... Pretty much right here in my own playthrough. I'm stuck in my own playthrough. Everyone can live here in Lockholm, but we, we welcome guests. You will mind your manners while you're here, won't you? Yeah, obviously. Oh, what's this kid have to say? <clears throat> when I grow up, I want to be just like Grandpapa. He makes most of the armor and weapons that you see in Gwelder. Huh. Greetings, trainer. The name is Ogron. I am the local blacksmith. Unfortunately, I don't believe I can be of service to you. You see, I haven't been able to forge any steel since I lost my blacksmithing tools. Everything I have here at the shop already has a buyer. Do you think you could help an old man out? Yeah, sure. Thank you. I promise to make it worth your while. Here's what I remember. I was bringing back lumber from Willowington Woods when a Pokemon stole my blacksmithing tools. I couldn't make out what it was, but it was very fast. It stole my tools and darted into a nearby bush. A blacksmith is nothing if he can't forge steel. Okay. This is an important quest because he gives me a sword, which I can use to uh, cut down trees and whatnot. I forget. Is there anything else over here? There's this Coliseum, which does have a quest in it, but I don't believe I will be able to complete that quest. I'm going to keep Axew out of the party because at current, I don't believe the game gets us to a level where we can evolve him. And until he evolves, he's kind of a wet sponge. Uh, well, a wet piece of paper. Very fragile and... Mm. Uh, Sligu is pretty good. How many range do I have? Four? Yeah, one, two, three, and four. Okay. Uh, I think I might just put Wooper back in. Take out Curlia? That is a good Pidgeotto. Yeah, I'll take out Curlia for now. Okay. It's a mission board. Duelist wanted. I am looking for a worthy opponent to test my skills. You can find me south of Lockholm in Seaside Cove. Yeah. Person. 
I have traveled a great distance to study under Professor Lo Dogwood. I just never imagined that his study would be like would look like this. I can't believe Dogwood has God with him. An amazing creature. And the one true religion of Pokemon. Most people don't know this, but Pokemon with the same typing work better together. Makes sense. I'm Master Adair's Royal Guard. I'm tasked with protecting him in his travels. Nice. Dogwood, you've kept me waiting long enough. Hand me the rare Pokemon you've prepared. I'll soon conquer the League and show my king show the king my greatness. You're in a good mood today, Adair. Of course I've been keeping a Fennekin for you. Fennekin? Ah, there, that is interesting, actually. So, in my own game, I started with, um, what is it, uh, Totodile, and what he gave to a dare was a Froki. So that's actually really cool and interesting. So he'll give you what, uh, the, um, what is that, that's Gen... Seven? He'll give you the Gen 7 starter? Or is it Gen 6? Gen 6. Sorry. He'll give you the Gen 6 starter for, uh... Your Pokemon's type. That's pretty cool. What, what is the... What is the... Nah. God, I can't get... It doesn't exude power status. Pokemon need to be trained to be... Oh, wait, whoopsie. Pokemon need to be trained to become strong, and I've heard enough. I'll have this Pokemon prove its strength to me against you. Dogwood, prepare for battle. Crystal, is that you? Your timing couldn't be better. Won't you entertain a dare in a battle? Yeah, sure. Dogwood, you dare put me up against a commoner? Rude. Crystal is from another land, a dare. I'm certain that she will be an interesting opponent. Hmm. <laughs> Very well. I'll show you your place, commoner. Adair, seventh heir to the throne, will be your opponent. Awesome. Yeah, this isn't going to go well for you. Uh, and then I'm going to... Let's... I'm going to take out you... Also, after this, I think I'll take out not to from my party. I know that would make my entire back line fire types, but uh, I think that would be worth it, honestly. Nice. Continue. You've done well to insult me. Dogwood Fennekin is useless. Worthless. I haven't seen a weaker Pokemon in my life. I could find a better one in the market. You didn't win, commoner. The tables were slanted after my visit to the shops. I'll show you. Dogwood, your gift belongs in the trash. Okay. Bye. Why would he throw... You know what? Fuck you. My Fennekin. It is a pleasure to see you again, Crystal. I... Professor, you won't believe what happened to me. Slow down, Bethany. What happened? Well, what happened was... And it was Crystal who saved me. That's quite the story. I'm glad you two made it back in one piece. Your victory over Master Dare was no surprise then, Crystal. Adair... Was that the kid who rudely stormed off? That kid is one of the potential heirs to the throne. We can't be disrespectful, Bethany. Crystal, Bethany mentioned you had something to ask me. What an interesting artifact. I'm not quite sure what that is, but it feels very... powerful. Dangerous, even. Just a moment. Not over here. It's not this, either. Crystal, I wish I had an answer. This item seems too perfect to have occurred in nature. Hmm. 
We need to learn about the material used to create it first. Try Fumo Depths and Mount Creation. The crafters there are the most skilled in Guelda. If anyone can dissect what kind of material is used, they would be the ones to do it. That sounds interesting. I'll see you as soon, Professor Green Crystal. I'm off to collect the next data sample for my project. Alright. Awesome. There's still plenty to do, but continuing this mission will not be possible until Beta 2.0. We are extremely excited to show you more. For more updates, please visit our Discord. And actually, you know, for anyone who wants to, go there. It's pretty chill Discord. Pretty nice. Uh, this guy will resurrect a fossil, I believe, if I bring him one. Or the academic skill of this research requires my attention. Research. Yes, I am researching the resurrection of fossils. They're mostly found hidden inside the walls of Veteris Canyon. If you find any, bring them to me. Anything else? No. Oh. Hooray! Which I think would only be good for not to if I keep it in my party. Which I don't think I will. Alright. So, out of the quests we have, uh, this one we can beat, well, this one we can do, this one we can do after we get the, um, the blacksmithing stuff so we can get the sword. We can't do that, I am not of level to do that yet, and this, I don't think I'm of level to do. What is my trainer level now? 24? I know that with all of the quests and trainers that are left, I believe I can get to 26. At which case, I will retry the, um, the bug gym. For now... This one, in my own game, actually took me a little while to uh, figure out what I was supposed to do. I thought I was just supposed to run over here and try to find the Pokemon that stole the items. And then I found out, no, it it's the Pokemon that the little girl was talking about that was in a bush. Oh wait, can Houndor evolve or is Houndor 25? Houndor is 25. Got it. Can I move you over? Because you're going to go up, yeah. I should have saved that rare candy that I used. Ugh, such a waste. Let's see, Pokemon... I'm not gonna use not to in this battle. Everyone else should be fine. item. What items do I have? That's a pretty good item. I should give him the leftovers. Um, yeah, actually. Because isn't... Yeah, Charmeleon's my most tanky Pokemon. Well, till I get you up, but for now, I'm going to give you this and you will get the, yeah. Oh. Turn 
just as a quick heal instead of going back to the fire pit, which is right there, but yeah, I'll investigate it. Yeah, it should be an easy battle. So I'm going to put you there. You here. I'm going to switch not to out. Ooh, yeah. That makes sense that I have four of that. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, let's do this. Oh. Hound door. go. I like the symbol above Golut. I don't think that was supposed to be there. Nice. Okay. If anything, I think at some point in the stream, I, I won't end the stream, but I will have to pause to, um, just grind out levels. Pause from doing, like, quests and whatnot is more what I mean. Uh, before I go over there, is this the party that I want? Because I now have the Fennekin. I think I do want that in my party. Both are one star. Oh, my god. No. Whoopsie. What's the fellow with a strong psychic energy? Okay. And what is Fennekin? Her and stare, which causes burn on the target. That's actually really good for fire. A guaranteed burn. I might switch out Houndor for the sole reason of dark is weak to bug. This is a hard one. Because I don't have another fire type. So it, I wouldn't be able to get the six fire types. I don't have another psychic type I really want to put in here. Besides for Curlia, but I don't think psychic is that good of a bonus. I'm not taking out Golut. Favorite Pokemon. I don't care if it's a bad choice. Uh, that's... I think Fennekin... Doesn't when Fennekin evolve, it's a uh, fire psychic? Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm going to take out Houndor. Uh, for now, I'm going to take out Wooper, because... Houndoom actually is really good in this game. Hold on. Whoopsie. Let's see, summary. You are 57 attack at level 24. Oh. Your 
so much better. But you will cause the photo burn. Your range is four units. What's Fennekin's range? Two units, so not as good. You are also your three units. What are you? Three units. <sighs> but all your attacks are dark. That's the problem here. I think I'll keep him in the party just so that he can get up one more uh, she, so that she can get up one more level, and then I can evolve her. Then I'll switch her out for Ludwig. Simply because I think I more need the fire typing for the bug gem. Why did I run in here? I'll give you your reward. It's it will just take a moment. Thank you. Hot, hot. Sorry, I was checking a message. I thought this would just go through. She's beautiful. There you are, as promised your reward. Thank you again, trainer. I obtained a sword. With that sword, you should have no problem clearing small trees. May my steel help you clear your path to victory. Okay. Did I not gain a trainer level? No. Alright. Okay. I, so, I don't think there's any consequence to just evolving Vulpix now in this one. In, um, in other games, there's the consequence of, you know, like, you won't get the same moves from level up or none at all, I think. But in this one, I don't think there's any consequences because you can't learn moves so I think it's just best to evolve when you can um, that will be really good for the battle that we're going into <clears throat> nice I believe it stays ranged. I should have double-checked that before I evolved. Yeah, it stays ranged. Oh, wait, do you have the highest defense in my party now? You do. Interesting. I will keep you then. You're definitely staying. Alright, so now we go down here to the guy who requested a battle. <clears throat> it's only been 30 minutes. Yeah, so this is one of the reasons why I said um, in the uh, beginning, I think I said this. And, uh, did I? Eh, whatever. Uh, and in the, you know, announcement for this stream and everything, I don't know how much I have... I really can do more, uh, but I will do my best to do as much as I can. Nice.
You don't look like you're from here. Want a battle? Uh, sure. Okay. Yep. Actually, that's a better matchup. And then I don't really have a matchup for that, so... Oh, wait. Luxio. There we go. Ooh. That is a lot of levels that Fennekin got. What level is Fennekin now? 13! Awesome. I can't wait till it evolves. I really hope that when it evolves it stays ranged. I would be kind of confused if the uh, Pokemon that evolves to be like a Witch and Magic Caster is not ranged when it evolves. Yeah, I'll plant a berry. Let's plant... this. And... Yeah. Yeah. This is generally not good for my team. Yeah, let's see how that works. Yeah, this is not going well. Because I didn't heal. This is on me if I lose. Thank you, Patchbot. I figured you guys could probably hear that. Nice. Oh, Fennekin can evolve. Okay, awesome. And I will go heal up all my Pokemon. Evolve. What? Okay. Still ranged. 7 energy gain. A damaging magical force that grabs the enemy and holds them for 5 seconds. As opposed to... But that doesn't really matter if I put... If I take out Houndor, once it can evolve, and I put in Litwick, then that doesn't matter because Litwick can burn people. So yeah, I'll, I'll evolve it. Nice. No time to head back up and, uh, no. Okay, not much. That's good. Oh, whoopsie. That was an accident. I was just pressing A over and over and then... Sorry, I went to default uh, how people play Pokemon. Just click the A button over and over again. Ooh. 
Which is also one of the reasons why I really enjoyed Arceus. When Arceus was out. Um, I still play it a little bit every now and then. But it was just such a good one. How much detect his breaks and have? Pokemon. 71 attack. For level 17, that's pretty good. Nine Tails is a beast. Oh my god, imagine a three star. Oh my god, a three-star uh, Vulpix is a, would be amazing. Ooh, are you done? Nope. Okay, so this is the guy that I gotta fight. Yes, I am your challenger. So you did see my request. Let's go. Okay. If I... Okay. Let's see... That... should be good. I might l also look into the community of this game a bit, because I am starting to wonder, is it better to just have a team of a single typing in this game? Or is it better to, like, vary out your team? Because with the bonuses, I could see it going either way. Oh, 25, yay! Nice. Trainer, you've definitely shown me on... Oh, right. Yeah, this is a typo in this. I'm pretty sure they meant one heck of a battle, but they just did on. Thank you. Nice. Okay, and then I think... No, you gotta be 26. What level am I? I'm 26. Awesome, okay. Um... Other things that I can do in this is there are a few places where I need a sword to get through some trees. So I'm going to go do that. Oh, dang it. Can I run? Oh yeah, that's something I found out. I Unless this was a mod and... <clears throat> I didn't notice it when I was watching someone play. But uh, apparently you can run from trainer battles in... Um... Oh, wait. Because you are just fire type. Yeah. So I'm going to take you out. Because against fire types, that is... Not something I want. have healed my Pokemon. I also don't like how these guard battles, like, they're over and over again, and they don't give any XP. That annoys me. Wait, is that Brazer? Okay, that Brazer is there. Because there's kind of no way around some of them, but there's no point in battling them. On the other hand, I guess that, you know, they couldn't just give you EXP every time if they're going to have it be a reoccurring battle. Uh, 
actually, who needs to level up? You're 25, you're 25. Everyone. Everyone needs to level up. Cool. Uh, but you are one of the ones that needs to level up the most, so. I hate that you fly to the other end of the map. I really wish you didn't, but, you know, whatever. Fossil. Which... The jaw fossil gives me Tyrant, if I am correct. Do not fly anywhere, please. Actually, because you always do, I'm going to put you over there. You there. You there. You can go there. Nice. Where are my Pokemon stats right now? Low health, but... Really... I just, I love the idea of Wooper with a knife. I should probably evolve Wooper. You can't evolve. 80 to 65. What are you? 9100. That is really good. Yeah, I'm gonna say Ninetales is my best Pokemon right now. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. I don't think there's a way for me to heal in this city. I have to leave the city. Which means I have to battle this guy. Hi. Yep, I know, I'm wanted. You there. You there with Fennekin. Ooh, that's uh, not going to be great for me. I think in the forest there's a coil. I'm not gonna do do the uh, the jaw fossil yet, simply because I don't see much point in doing it at the moment. Oh, uh, no, ground type. So I like Wooper's putting things to sleep. That's really useful. You have anything to say? Okay. I think this is just to... Yeah. 
just a quick way through. There's a quick way through the other way as well. That I completely forgot about. Nice. I'm trying to remember all the places that there would be a tree to cut down. I think I've gone to all or most of them already. Oh wait, no. It's this way. Beat it up. I need levels anyway, so. I think this is the part of the stream after I get this chest. Oh, wait. Is this a random item? No. Okay, good. <sighs> Give item. I just thought about that, because uh, I think the chests are random. Nice, 26, 26, 20. Ooh, 26, good. 21, 25. I believe with that, Houndor can evolve, right? Yep. Yeah. Don't know why that wasn't in there. Pulse of Dark Energy. Yeah. Houndoom is a great Pokemon in this. The problem is he does dark type attacks, which... Yeah, look at those numbers. Not as good as Ninetales, though. Ninetales has some good numbers. Yeah, because Luxio would be frontline. I need the frontline people. You know, I want to check really quickly. When does uh, Natu evolve? Because if it's by level 26. Level 25. Okay. <clears throat> Wait. Okay, yeah. He's level 20. Because uh, that evolution might make a huge difference in this. After I do the gym, I will be putting Houndoom back in the party. Great Pokemon. Okay. Oh, forgot. I gotta switch him out. I was going to put Litwick back in. I know Litwick doesn't evolve before level 26. So Litwick is, I think, somewhere in the 30s. Could be wrong on that. Okay. Time to level up everyone else. Oh, or is, is there a tree I can cut down up here? No. No? No. Oh, can I plant stuff here? Yes, I can. Um... Yeah, I'll plant that. That's a good one. Okay, that one's not uh, fertile yet. Uh, 
And I did fight the guy over here already. Oh wait, isn't Golet already 26? I have to look at my Pokemon party again. This might be my bad. Pidgeotto's 26. Golet is 26. Okay, oh, I didn't have a full team in there. Whoopsie. Okay, so Golet and Pidgeotto can sit out from now on. Good, that means I can switch out the entire front line. Yeah, as I said, now we're on to the grinding. I did not mean to do that. Oh, can I plant stuff up there now? I should really go around and see where I can plant stuff, because the berries might be useful for just the Pokemon that, you know, I don't really have an item for. Might be. They will be useful. Ooh. Awesome. Soil needs time. Soil needs time. Okay. What about over here? Okay, so it needs time, so I can't. But I think some of the older ones that were in the original towns I can do. Oh. Rakeson's ability is really good when it doesn't grab something that's about to die. Ooh, that actually might be what I need to get uh, Heracross out of the way. That's a plan. I could have the boost defense. Yeah, I got an idea for this. That I hope will work. <sighs> yes, what berry should I plant? Gain 30 energy at the start of the battle. That, yeah. Okay, I can give that to Brakeson. Five HP can be held. No. I'm gonna plant that. What else I got? I need agility. Well. That might be useful. Yeah. Let's see, where else can I plant stuff? Oh, is everything up there done? Yes. Okay, can't plant there.
I just realized I planted these pretty soon after I said we're probably not going to catch any Pokemon anymore. And the reason for the Lum is to catch stuff. So... That's fine. I can work around that. Nine tails is 26, which means I should probably put Lit uh, Litwick in. Yes. Thank you. Awesome. I don't think there's anywhere else where I can plant stuff. Okay, and then Litwick needs to be leveled up, so I'm gonna take out nine tails. But I do think nine tails and breaks in are the trick to uh, beating that one gym. 26, awesome. 26. Awesome. How much more of my party do I need to... Not much! My party's looking pretty good. stop the more I hope things will uh, finish growing oh hound door Take your time, Wooper. Oh. I should be able to do this. The party that I got. I think putting breaks in and Charmeleon across from the oh, across from the uh, Heracross will be my best move. Because Brakeson can hold him in place while Charmeleon just wails on him. That actually might give me enough points to get up another level, which then might mean I can get past that guy who's guarding the bridge. Also means I have no clue how I'm going to be doing that in my personal game, because I start with a water type. Oh, not two can evolve. If I'm correct. Yeah, 
What changes? So, who you get another unit of a, of a range? I think. Who? Versus. I mean, it becomes that there's no use for his item, but. Yeah, I think I will evolve. Nice. That's some good damage numbers. There are good numbers all around. Uh, let's see, how many of my Pokemon do I need to still ra uh, raise up? Oh, just the three backline? Brackline? Backline. I cannot talk today. Pretty good. Or, I mean, Zatu. Nice, nice. Zatu is the only one that still needs to level up. I don't know if this will do it. <laughs> yeah, didn't think so. I think what's kind of tripping me up about this game is how, in general, you do not play it uh, like a normal Pokemon game. Like, there's still the type advantages and everything. Okay, I don't need to fight anything anymore. There's still the type advantages, but in general, it's not the same, because... In normal Pokemon games, how I would normally play things is like I switch out to uh, whatever would be super effective, or I make sure that all of my Pokemon have multiple moves that could be super effective or that are super effective. Uh, right now, I'm just heading back to get the berries. But uh, multiple moves for like type coverage and whatnot, it's one of the reasons why I really like uh, Golurk and Gardevoir. Golur can learn all the punching moves, which gives him a lot of type coverage. I believe he can even learn a grass type move, uh, ground type moves, etc. He has a lot of type coverage. Gardevoir also has a lot of type coverage. So both are really good. Um, Luxio and Luxray uh, can learn all the bite moves. The only one that's better with the bite moves is Tyrant, because it also has strong jaw. So normally I would, you know, make sure my team has all these Pokemon that have good type coverage. Um, I would generally make them for type coverage rather than uh, gimmicks or whatever. But in this one... It seems like the main thing is, like, you're going to have to switch out your team from time to time. Okay. Let's get in here. Hoping I won't have to reset or anything. So 
I am going to give my Pokemon items. Give item. Okay, 30 energy. Give. Um... Give... Who am I giving this to? Zot to. Alright, I'm gonna give you this as well. Yeah. Kid oh, whoopsie. Uh, okay, well that was an accident. Uh, what should I name this guy? I might just get... Whoopsie. Give item. Litwick, I think... I would give that. Okay, I think I have everyone set up for how I want. I'm going to do a save here. Let's hope that I can do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maritime, blah, blah, blah. Bugs. This one should be simple. Um... I want Golut for the final battle. Okay. Nice. Yeah, this works. Because I want my fire types and Golut into in for the final battle. I do not like that most of them have already eaten their berries, but whatever. Good, good, Charmeleon can heal. Okay, that was good. I think this is the final battle before... Okay. I think I'm just gonna have to go ahead with this. Fine. OK. 
Okay. We're all good here. I've not lost much, so I'm gonna have you there, you there. Try you for backline. Go let. Okay. And. You are so weak. I'm going to put in you. That would basically refresh the entire front line. Not entirely, but most of it at least. I get the ghost type and the fire type bonus. I think this will be good. actually might still be fine. Heracross is weak enough. Nope. So close. Okay. New plan. New plan is to keep Charmeleon out and healthy for as long as possible. And I think in the final one, I'm going to have to have a Zatu in there. Okay, that one was easy. But also that. Yeah. Okay, so far so good. Then I have one more battle after this, I believe. Is Heracross healing itself? If that's so, then wow. That would explain why I haven't been able to do well in this. Breakson, I want to have health, so... Why, hello there! How are you? Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> I am trying my best to make sure that it does not destroy my hopes and dreams. But... We'll see. Uh... 
I'm mainly having things focus on the Heracross right now. Cause that that is the biggest problem. There we go. Yeah. Just so that you know, because I won this, this was like my 10th attempt at this. Uh, I did so before, I tried doing so before when I was a bit under level. And then I tried a few times when I was of level and then over level, but yeah, positioning is really key in this game. Well, Fod Crystal. You showed grit, determination, and unwavering will that kept focused during the unrest, uh, during the unresting battle. As keeper of the swarm badge, I tested you for that quality. You are deserving. Crystal obtained the swarm badge. Nice. The road ahead is a long one, but I know you are capable. Is Rattata actually that good in this game? I don't think I ever caught one because generally I don't. At least in the beginning of the game, I then come back for it because I always finish the Pokedex. What? <laughs> that is hilariously broken. What? I gotta go catch a Rattata now. Oh, so the spark becomes a flame. My sense about you is correct. You may be the one I have been searching for. With that, I offer you a challenge. Defeat Gwelder's best and prove your merit. Awesome. Did I gain a level? No, I did not. Pow Frontier ask, please. Just have a team of Radata. <sighs> what do you mean just stop? Like, it just wouldn't attack anymore? Is here where I can get a Radata? Ah, got it. Where can you get a Rattata in this game? I forget. Because I feel like it's not where I'm running. So was the Battle Frontier ask place. Okay. Ah. I feel like I've fought one in battle before though. Although that might have just been a trainer. I know you can find... Ooh, Hone Edge. I want to catch that Hone Edge. Ah, a little slow on the catch button. The guy who's blocking the... Yeah, because you can find Radicate. Uh, the guy who's blocking the path to Mount Creation, is that like 
a beatable battle right now, or am I just bad at the game? Is there a prize corner here? Oh. Okay. So it's possible just ungodly hard. Ooh, Amora. Changmo's in this game? Wow, there's a lot of Pokemon in this game. Okay, let's try this. Oh wait, before I do, get this quest. I don't think what I, ha I have what it takes, but you know, we'll see. Enter the Coliseum. I guess draft? What is draft? The battle draft tests you as a trainer. Provide you with some Pokemon and your goal is to win as many consecutive rounds as you can. After every round you will be able to pick a single Pokemon from your opponent's team to replace a Pokemon on your team. Ooh, would you like to enter the Yeah, sure. Yeah. That seems fun. Is it meant to be ungodly hard because, like, that's pretty much where this version of the game ends? Research on your opponent. They have a Pharaoh Seed in Paris. I'm not sure about the remaining Pokemon they have. You'll have to pick three Pokemon for your team. I will show you some Pokemon and you must pick one from each pool for your team. Good luck. Here's the next pool. Ooh, Slugma. Did I see anything on them? Summary, okay. Rising Heat gains two agility and loses one for every hit taken. I don't really want you to take. That's not a great attack. I'll take you. Ugh. Yeah, ooh, Mel Meltan's in this game? All I know is that this thing definitely has things that are weak to- this person definitely has things that are weak to, um... Fire. I should have been looking at the stars. Or not, because I think this is a three star, because... Defense and agility are not great. Did I miss something? Oh! I should be paying more attention, honestly. I did not choose a great team to go up against a toe to dial. Oh, I, sh I was not paying attention to that. I should have been. That would have been great for the team. And now I lose because I did not pay attention to that Mel uh, Meltan. I swear I'm better at other Pokemon games. Alright. 
I knew they had a toad at all. Ah! Why didn't you tell me? Victory. Terms have earned you four merits. Awesome. What would you like to do next? Uh, next round. So turn your opponent. They have a Ralts and a Blitzel. That would be Psychic Fairy and Electric. Previous opponent's team. Pharaoh Seed might actually be pretty good against the Electric type. One sixty-eight defense. Not much attack, but let's see. What is your summary? Just the agility of any attack. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, that Paris is actually okay. I think I'm gonna go with Ferris Seed. That would be a bad choice. Uh, actually, yeah. Seems like it actually will be fine. Fairseed actually held its ground. Next round. Who yaw mask? Uh, what is your ability? Passes its energy through a current to allow to the ally who has done the least damage. I mean, yes. I completely agree. I That's the entire reason I chose it. Just like Geodude could probably hold its ground. But let me think. Uh, Yamask and... I forget what the other one was. Blitzel? That could be good. I don't know what this ability of it does. But that could be good. Eh, well, it's a subpar, honestly. Geodude has the highest attack and the highest defense. What is Geodude's ability? Again. Foe and rocks, reducing the foe's agility by 8%. I think I'm going to go for Blitzel. A support roll instead. Try beating my team. Yeah. That should work. Let's do the attack. That's true. What? Oh, is that? Oh, maybe it's a uh, electric current like boosts the agility or attack at the least. Oh, that's actually pretty good because Ferrisseed would probably be the one that always has the least attack, and if it keeps upping Ferrisseed, then huh? Okay, then yeah, that would probably make it nice. For Ferris Seed. Oh no, Ratata. Is 
So that would be a normal type. Let's see. That is... What is that defense? It does! My status effects are cured, and allies gain 5% attack for each cured status. That's pretty good. Plus now I have two ghost types on my team. Okay, I have to see this. A bite that has a 20% chance to one-hit KO the enemy otherwise deals damage. What? <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're focusing on God first. Good. Actually should be a pretty good... God, I feel like I it is somewhere in the wild. God, I didn't get that 20%. Nice. I will have to look. Like, uh, after this, I'm going to go out and I'm going to find Eradicate. What do you do? That's not really going to be helpful on my team. Oh, thank you for the follow. But yeah, after this... I will definitely go out and find Eradicate, just to double check on it. Oh, I have to get rid of someone from my team. If I had to get rid of someone... Probably say Slugma is the least holding its ground, but without Slugma, I only have Yamask for the background back uh oh yeah the top percentage yeah i only have yaw mask for my back row i do like golet it is because its ability yeah ha <laughs> uh let's see Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of Slugma. Because Ferrisseed is really good for just being a tank in the front ground. View here. That's pretty good. Pharisee is not as good here, though. Everything should be fine. <sighs> ah, Ratata, why didn't you do it? I think you're right. I think what Blitzel does is it increases agility. I like that they're staring at me. Uh, next round. Honage and Gumi. It's a pretty good middle ground. What is your summary? Full energy at random stat is boosted by 50%, but another stat... Mm. 
It's a shard of ice and smashes it on the foe, freezing it for one second. Maybe. KO'd each finishing blow reduces that chance by 10%. That's a pretty good tank. But it doesn't have as much defense as Pharisee'd. Uh, I'm gonna go with this boy. Freezing is pretty good. Now, who do I get rid of? Probably go let. No, but then I will lose all of my type bonuses. This is a hard one. I'll get rid of Charmander. Yeah. Probably a bad choice, but you know. Oh, right, Hone Edge. I needed Charmander. Okay. Ignore my bad decisions. Oh, is Dreepy like a support character? Hmm. I have no clue what Dreepy was doing. Pharisee, please. Only gonna go to the next round because Kakuna and okay. What was Treepy doing? Lashes onto the nearest ally, floating around it like a halo. The ally gains thirty percent stats. Okay, that is helpful, but. Also, then takes out a Pokemon from my party. Uh, that's pretty good. Oh! That is a tank. That is also a tank. I'm gonna go with you. So it wouldn't be able to hold off as much as Pharisee, but it would... Actually, I know Rattata is god, but... I have not been winning that 50-50, or 80-20. I'm sorry. Yeah, that should be good. Nice. 
Um, no, I'm going to quit here. I do want to see, what is Raticate's ability? I'd have to run down to get to him. That's not a radit uh, eradicate. There are these. <gasps> I found it. Oh, this is actually a horrible idea if it gets the. I gotta try to catch it before uh, it had a chance. Wait, what is. Eh, whatever. I'll give it that. Uh. Lock eyes? Alright, there we go. Quags are die. Okay. Compliment. Uh, there we go. No, just to find that eradicate. Because I do want to see what is. There's eradicate. What is eradicate's ability? Alright, so it gets rid of the chance to one hit KO. But it does do a lot of damage. Which is kind of what Super Fang is in the games as well. I always hate that move. I love it when my Pokemon attack the thing that I don't want them to attack. But oh well. Okay, Paris does heal itself. Nice. 
Oh, I never revived the fossil I got. I should do that. Skill this research. I have a fossil. Stir this Pokemon. Please come back in a bit. My solution will take time. Okay. I guess I just sit at a campfire for a bit. Can't go up there. Thank you. I think I'm going to go try that one battle. How much money do I have? Enough. Is there anything over here I could get to further increase my odds of winning that battle? Not at current, it seems. No, oh, that's that. Hmm. Alright. I will have to do that battle coliseum a lot. <clears throat> but first, I do want to see, can I get through that, or should I actually do the Colosseum a bunch? I have a guess of what it's going to turn out to be, but I want to at least try. What are those two? Why did I plant those? Ooh, okay, that's actually good. Okay, let's see, Pokemon. Done from specials. Give item. Alright, let's see if I can do this. If I can't, my guess is I would have to go to the Coliseum to do a bunch of battles 
just to... What time is it? Okay. Um, just to get all the materials I would need, like the items for my Pokemon to hold, so that I can actually run through this. Do Okay, blah ha ha. Let's see. In my own opinion This is the one that's the biggest problem. And we'll see how this goes. So I'm hoping once I get rid of one of these. Okay. actually is this gonna work Ooh. oh oh ah Zatu is the winning number <laughs> not number but the winning Pokemon Ugh, a proper- Oh, I can get my Pokemon up to level 27 now! Yes! Oh, I feel so great for that. Okay. Satu's a great Pokemon, if you position it correctly. Because it constantly raises its attack and defense. And, by giving it that berry so that it could heal itself... Also, I have a 3-star one, so, you know. There's that. Okay. Sweet. I was afraid that this was going to turn out that I would have to, like, end things here because I didn't have anything else to do. Plenty to do, but this area will not be available until beta 2.0. You're extremely excited to show you more. Updates, please. Oh. Well. <clears throat> uh. That kind of defeated my whole excitement, but. Still, happy I did that. That was great. I actually don't think there's anything left for me to do in this. There are 10 gym leaders here, okay. Can't do that, because that's not the game yet. Oh, I can do this. You're the kid that picked up the mission from the board. Y you chased him off? <laughs> sure you did. I'm going to be straightforward with you here. I don't believe you. Prove to me your strength. <sighs> okay. Oh, this is a much easier battle. Just throw fire types in. The fire. What was I thinking? Water types are what I need here.
Nice. Arr, you definitely, you're definitely a tough one. My apologies for thinking otherwise. Have your reward, recruit. Nice. Am I now 28? Nope. Okay. Why did I never change my title? Nope. I never did change my title. So I think I think this is the only quest that I have left. And I don't know if I'm going to do that one on stream. Has been about two hours since I started streaming. At four, I have to go do something. So. I'm gonna get back to the town and decide. Because. If all I have left to do is just the Colosseum, I might end things here. As after that, I will spend the rest of the time that I have till what I have to do, um, which is 30 minutes. Sorry, I just realized that other people would be in different time zones, and if I just said four, then... It wouldn't matter. Um, but I have somewhere to be in like 30 minutes. I might just spend the rest of the 30 minutes um, figuring out what game to play next. Uh, Xavier, if you're still there, if you know of any good ROM hacks or anything that I could play next, please feel free to share. Because I think I will just end here. What? Really quickly, what are the Pokemon I can get here? Lotad, Elekid... Ryolu is a pretty good Pokemon. And Jangmo. Okay, so there's enough for me to do here, at least in my own time, to just grind out these and get a bunch of Pokemon until the next update for this game. But I don't think I've, I don't think I'm gonna do that grinding out on stream unless people want me to. Um, but anyway, uh, I think I am gonna end the stream here. Thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for chatting with me. Thanks for the information on the Rattata and uh, other stuff in this game. But uh, I think that'll be it. So I hope everyone who watches this has a nice evening. And uh, yeah, bye.